greetings and salutations. Uh, free Bible to uh, anybody subscribes. See how that gets you. Alright. Getting into it, right? This came from Neil deGrasse Tyson. I've read it off before and I will read it again in Neil's voice. What are the lessons to be learned from this journey of the mind through the universe? That humans are emotionally fragile, preniably gullible, hopelessly ignorant, masters of an insignificantly small speck in the cosmos. Have a nice day. Neil deGrasse Tyson quoted. What jerk. I honestly have a serious opinion of that dude. But then check out this from Thomas Winship, a uh, Zedek cosmologist. A cosmogenesis. The law of gravitation is said by the advocates on the Newton system of astronomy to be the greatest discovery of science and the foundation of the whole of modern astronomy. If therefore it can be shown that gravitation is a pure assumption and an imagination of the mind only, that it has no existence outside of the brains of its expounders and advocates, the whole of the hypothesis of this modern and so-called science fall to the ground as flat as the surface of the ocean and this most exact of all sciences, this wonderful feat of the intellect becomes at once the most ridiculous superstition and the most gigantic imposture to which ignorance and credulity could ever be exposed. So in other words, gravity is bullshit. Ah, and so stupidly followed when people realize that they've been being fooled all this time. They're gonna feel stupid and they're gonna be very angry. Remember that. Uh, a lot of the people that, that learn now aren't gonna be so angry, but there's going to be a lot of angry people out there. And they're not going to want to turn. They're very... Anyway, like, here's a quick... I'm going to leave you with uh, some quick Bible facts. Uh, do you know the Bible is, like, the bestseller of all time? It's a collection of 66 books. It has 40 authors written in three different languages over three different continents. And it was written over a period of 1,500 years. It's the most freely given book in the world. And ironically, also the most shoplifted book in the world. It's the only book that's actually banned in some countries. Yet it's reliable, verifiable, and confirmed. So... Please like and subscribe.